Hey lovelies, it's Victoria. I'm at the art museum. I'm on the lookout point, which is beautiful. Um, the art museum was built uh, for the 1904 World's Fair, so one of the last buildings left from that World's Fair. This is the Grand Basin, which is extraordinary. A lot of people out today. It is a beautiful day. And here is the art museum. Nifty, right? Gorgeous. I was just inside real quick to see the uh, current exhibit, which is a uh, German art from like the 1700s to modern times. And um, so I promised a big announcement. So what I'm gonna do is flip this around. Hi, <laughs> come here and I'll put the museum in the background. So it'd be pretty. So I am excited uh, to share with you that, um, yes, uh, website, I finally got it up and you can get my first two ebooks re-released ones that came out earlier this year. Um, a Stairway, which is a steampunk kind of mystery suspense thriller, a little bit of romance, and uh, the first of the vampire series, The Long Moonlight, are on my website now. So what I'm going to do is after I'm done with this live, I'm going to save it and then I'll attach the links to the website. All you have to do, and I'll also have a, a walk through how you get onto it and find those free books. Um, but you get on the website and you shop all, and then you see the two books there um, that will pop up and it shows that they're on sale. So I am so excited. I'm going to post this all over social media. So it'll be on TikTok, Tumblr, uh, Twitter, Facebook, of course, and my Facebook group, um, the Society Fans. Um, where else was I missing? Oh, TikTok, of course. I'm going to go live on TikTok probably in about an hour. So, um, but yeah, so lovely to share this with you. St. Louis statue, Louis the Ninth. I am in front of the St. Louis Art Museum. And um, I remember, so I came to go see a great exhibit. I wanted, mostly wanted to see the German art because um, the, uh, the gentleman that did the illustrations for um, the Grimm's Fairy Tales from the 1800s, we have a couple of those pieces here. Hi, everybody that's watching. <laughs> uh, Carol. Laval, welcome. So yeah, I'm in St. Louis and it is a crisp cold day. And again, I'm at the art museum. And if you missed it, again, uh, a new way to get my eBooks for free. Um, they're on my website. I finally got it done. Um, and I'm gonna post that in the links, uh, in the comments below, link it up. Uh, I have a video on how to find it on the website. Um, it's been a long time coming. Um, if you prefer, to use Barnes and Noble, it is on Nook free. It is not free on Google, iBooks, or Amazon. Uh, that they would not let me do free. So, but this I can do free. And um, I have and one more surprise, if you're still watching, uh, I am going to start offering subscriptions. So what you can do is I will have like a, basically a monthly magazine with some links and things, and you will get that with some goodies. So um, you can put in the comments what comfortable you would like to, or what level of comfortability you feel like paying to get some things. It would include books, jewelry, steampunk stuff, um, vampire stuff, you know, some rare things that only subscribers would get. So, or if you visited me at a con, that's like, like Comic Con. So that's the big surprises for today. I wish you all a most happy and wonderful new year. Um, again, from St. Louis, to around the world, I wish you all a better 2021 and a better new year than we had this year. Again, um, I'll be saving this link for later. Hey, Morris. <laughs> Sorry, people are popping on all of a sudden. So yeah, here's my St. Louis Art Museum. And uh, they, they're just closing now. It's uh, three o'clock here in the United States. I know it's about 9 p.m. over in the UK. Um, and it's a brilliant day out here. Um, chilly it's in the 30s um, and this was one of the if you've just joined it's one of the original buildings left from the 1904 World's Fair and as I announced yeah I'm gonna have my website is gonna have free books on there and you can do subscriptions and get things later so um, this is just a way of me organizing it better um, and then you know after that if you subscribe you'll get 
you know, free access to books and stuff. So quite the day. I'm going to flip this back around and show you the Grand Basin. Yeah. So can you imagine? Look at that incline. And this was part of the Grand Promenade for the 1904 World's Fair. So all of this was filled with beautiful um, late Victorian Edwardian buildings from all over. <laughs> really super nifty. Um, this is a place everybody comes sledding when it's snowy and wintry. You can see you got quite the hill, pretty gorgeous. If you guys have any questions, ask me real quick before I zip off and go get warm. It's a little chilly. It was hot in the museum running around in my coat. Um, and what I think is hilarious here is the St. Louis statue is wearing a mask. So even St. Louis is being safe. So pretty, pretty cool. Yes, it's a little bit windy, um, Morris. It's uh, just a slight wind, so it is quite chilly. But I'll give you a better look at the museum. And it is one of the coolest places. I've, I've shot some steampunk pictures here and it's been really, really awesome. Uh, they put on a new wing about, I guess it's already been about five, 10 years ago. And so um, if you're watching from somewhere else in the world, it's about 3 p.m. in the United States and St. Louis is in the center, almost smack center of the country. There's a cool, if you see that silver tree over there, you see two people walking away towards those lights. That is a real sculpture. It's called imposter or something like that. It's pretty cool. So if you're a big fan of architecture and you like things, again, this is, you know, uh, was built for the 1904 World's Fair. And it's one of the few buildings left. Yeah. So I got a chance to be off work today, folks. I'm gonna flip this around. I'm so excited to be off work. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, so Morris, it's late there over in the UK. Um, are you in London? Morris, are you, did you visit people home in Scotland? And um, yeah, it's, eh, oh, I mean, it's chilly. And like I said, it's slightly windy, but it is really, really gorgeous. I know tonight I'm basically gonna park it at home and um, relax. I've got pizza and snacks and cookies and stuff. Oh, sir and slow, okay. All right, Morris, hopefully you're all bundled up and safe from, from the virus. Oh. Like I said, folks, I really hope everyone has a safe and happy new year and healthy. I know so many people that get COVID, family members. Um, I, I have an aunt that's in the hospital with cancer, so this is just not, you know, I'm worried for her, but she is in hospice and, you know, just hoping it's not any worse. Yeah, I saw nobody allowed to travel out of UK. Um, we're not there yet over here. Um, we've managed, St. Louis City has actually done a pretty good job of people staying masks, uh, staying masked and uh, keeping restrictions tight on restaurants and activities. So um, in case you're curious, they, um, so we've got all that going for us and it's kept the infection rate down, which has been really good. So we haven't been forced out right close. Um, so that's been a good thing. So lots of good things coming in the new year. Um, it's getting windier and I'm getting cold. So uh, quick list. Thank you everybody for supporting me this year. I'll definitely do a year wrap up uh, probably over the weekend and post that all over social media and in the blog. Um, and again, we're to get the free books now and if you wanna to subscribe to my website. So thanks folks. Happy, happy, safe and blessed new year wherever you are. Bye.